It's Maya and Miguel, brother and sister and best friends as well. What is up, guys? Welcome back to Pips Got the Tea. Y'all, I had to take a nice social detox. I needed that. I feel so energized and recharged. Oh my goodness, y'all. I had to, you know, put me together a little cleansing bath as well. Um, I am working on putting that on my website. Oh my gosh, I love that bath. Um, it's return to sender, cleanser, and the house of manifestations all in one. So be on the lookout for that. Thank you guys for joining me. Thank you guys for the birthday wishes. I really enjoyed my birthday. I was around the people that I love and yeah, like I'm a I'm a I'm a simple person. <laughs> I I am I can't admit like oh hell no I'm seeing shit. Have anybody else been seeing things like I've been seeing like shadows and outlines of people and shit. <laughs> okay but yeah that's besides the point so thank you guys for joining me today we are here today to tap into the energy of i heard do a collective i really want to do a divine feminine tap in though we're gonna do a divine feminine tap in i'm here at collective maybe i'll do a collective next now as y'all remember oh excuse me okay confirmation <laughs> as y'all remember i told y'all february was going to be a month of a lot of illusions it's a lot of love circulating around february however there were a lot of illusions circulating as well um february is the month where a lot of things started to align um hence this new moon that full moon that we had uh the full moons you know really helped me release things that were pulling you away from focusing on yourself this new moon will be breaking ties with anything that is not meant so yeah it's gonna be a lot of illusions because a lot of people do not want to let go i am currently in the process of uploading the who is sending you evil i read um you guys check your sign out i have to do fire signs and water signs and then i will be done i do want to do a collective um a collective evil I read as well because I feel like a lot of people need to be aware of what energy is coming towards them what energy is around them and what energy is not yours all right so we're going to do this divine feminine tap in holy spirit holy angels God of the most high God almighty I ask that you come within this reading to make it less of me and more of you allow me to tap to the energy of my divine feminines all right and let's see what is going on we still got like what like another week so i'm not gonna do the march we're gonna do what's going on now with my divine feminine so holy spirit what is going on with my divine feminine right now what is going on with my divine feminine energy let's see let's see let's see okay the path karma desires ew ew okay definitely i see a lot of a lot of divine feminines are focusing on your path right now you might be seeing a lot of fours four 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 as well y'all are seeing karma play out good karma is starting to come in for y'all as well as the karma that people earn for themselves what's that saying i hope you live the life that you deserve yeah so you guys might be seeing um two 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 a lot as well Yes, I feel like a lot of you guys are desiring to just be in a loving, kind energy. So you guys are surrounding yourself with people that help you feel that beautiful ass loving kind energy. So I definitely see a lot of you guys pulling away from people that kind of disrupt your energy. Yes, you guys are realizing the impermanence of things and still having compassion for people as they are falling out of your life. Yes, because I feel like you guys are really putting an effort for it to be happy in y'all life y'all really are oh ooh. right now you guys might be in the energy of finding things out um some of you guys have the option i feel like to reconnect with somebody um i feel like it's a situation that you guys have unconditional love for somebody some forgiveness some forgiveness might need to you know some forgiveness might be needed right now but i also feel like it's letting things go so i feel like you guys could be letting go of things you know even people that you have unconditional love for releasing things with love this could also be that you guys are needing to forgive you know forgive somebody for something yes for the sake of peace and keep your thoughts pure 
Yeah, some of you guys could have realized that someone had not accepted themselves. And that's, somebody could have pulled back from you. Somebody could have pulled back from you guys. When I feel like they wanted to attach to you. They wanted to be with you. They wanted to be near you. But I feel like somebody could have been pulling back. And they've been unhappy since they've been pulling back from you. Somebody was not learning their lesson. And now they're impatient. But they have not learned their lesson. This could also be you guys. Maybe you guys are pulling back from something or somebody that you guys could have, you know, that that's good for you. And now y'all seeing like, damn. What's that uh, party next door song? You gave me a piece of my own, all my time. All I needed was a piece. All I needed was a piece. Some of y'all, some of y'all could have gotten a taste of what peace was like within a connection, within a project. This is like, damn, like y'all got a taste of something. This could be you or somebody else. And it's like, I need that. I fucking need that in my life. All right, what's going on, my divine feminist, Holy Spirit? Things are unraveling right now. Y'all are going through an awakening. Things are unraveling. Y'all are waking up. Y'all are waking up to things that I feel like y'all have been contemplating about. So whatever has been on y'all mind, things are starting to come to the forefront. Yes. I feel like a lot of you guys are really looking at people for who they are. You guys are really seeing people for who they are. Their truth. Their true self. And this could be within communities. Yes. I feel like you guys are ready to walk away and celebrate mystery in a new direction. Y'all don't know how something gonna play y'all, but y'all know it's y'all winning season. Some of y'all could have just came out of a period of pausing. Or y'all could currently be in a, a, a period of taking a moment to yourself. Yes, to find your peace again. Some of y'all are y'all are manifesting and y'all listening to what the universe is saying. The universe is saying it's time for you to go on the adventure and that you protect it and to see the beauty in things and that to, you need to wake up and realize who you are. Stop being stubborn and coming to unity of, of what's destined for you. Yes, while you guys are in, in solitude or have been in solitude, you guys are acknowledging what I feel like you guys have been running from. So let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Where my cards at? What's going on, my divine feminines? Ooh, I split my deck three of swords and lovers. There is some type of heartbreak out here within a love connection. Somebody could have been playing the field, weighing their options, and now somebody is heartbroken because somebody wants to be alone. Somebody could be blocking out somebody's efforts or trying to to reconcile with them and somebody is heartbroken some of y'all can have somebody in their feelings because when you was trying to give give them your love like they was trying to play the field they was trying to play the motherfucking field and now they just like damn i don't know i don't know what the fuck to do now what is going on with my divine feminist holy spirit what is going on with my divine feminists i heard two parts a separation and a union and union Okay, so we're going to do two two different spreads. What's going on with my divine feminists and separation with their person? Mmm. Oh, y'all. All right, so for my divine feminists and separation with their person, um, it's very much given. Somebody had to sever some ties. Somebody had to get rid. This could even be family members that somebody having to cut off. Taurus energy. Um, somebody could have had to get out of some type of contract. Yes. What is this six of swords in reverse? Mm hmm. Somebody had to end something. Somebody was stuck in the middle of having to. I heard having to provide. For two situations. And they, they seen they had to put an end to that shit. They couldn't keep going on like that. Six of Pentacles with this seven of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody is somebody is right now, they looking over their money like, I cannot keep giving to multiple situations. Because I'm only going to have, you feel me, so much for my damn self. This is also like a motherfucker knowing like, I need to go ahead and cut something out so I can make the changes in the offer that I want to make to somebody. What is this death card? This is Scorpio energy. What is this death card? What is they having to put an end into? Mm. Somebody could have, somebody could have had to stop. Somebody could have, what is this Ace of Wands? Somebody went back. <laughs> somebody went back to somebody. It's very much giving somebody like... 
it's one of those like i heard anything you can do i can do better okay it's given somebody went back to something and started like started a new cycle with them passion wise somebody could have gotten cold to you guys because they went back to something and they realized like they need to put an end to that shit and be be strong oh shit i'm about to call nephew back i gotta be strong and stand on my own yeah and the same energy that they gave y'all, this person know that when they come back, that's the energy y'all gonna be in. They don't know what decision you gonna make. Yeah, but whoever this is, they know they gotta do something. Cause they looking at their happiness. They like, you know what? I've been moving like this for so long and I see where I would be happy at. Clarify this King of Pentacles. Yeah, whoever this is, they crying behind a third party now. Yeah, they crying because they tried to have control over something. Well, what did they not see? They didn't see that it was causing a tower. And they apologized. Some of y'all intuitively picked up on somebody trying to play the fucking field with y'all. I'm getting... Some of y'all already knew. Some of y'all could already fucking knew. And just didn't say nothing. Y'all want to see how far somebody was going to go. Somebody know they got to apologize. Somebody know they got to apologize. Who is this third party? Who's the third party for my divine feminists? Who's the third party for my divine feminists? Mm. Now, whoever this third party was, I feel like they they either watched, they watched the progression of something. Um, could have been with you and your person, and it kind of it, it made they blood boil. This could also be this person is watching y'all now, and they going whoever this third party is, they going through some shit right now. Shit not going right, and they realizing that whoever the fuck they with or dealing with, that that person don't have real like that person don't really fuck with them like that emotion wise. They don't know what to do, but they don't, they, they trying to, it's giving like stagnate something because they don't want something to wrap up. They don't want something to wrap up. This person, this could have been somebody that your person dealt with back in the day and this person could have cheated on them. And they starting to see that this person starting to get over their bullshit. Mm -hmm. They could have moved in real fast to slow something down with you and your person. And I feel like now... Your person is looking at things differently. They looking at things differently. It's like, I gotta let this sneaky shit go. I gotta let this sneaky shit go. Mm. This third party don't realize, though, that whoever the fuck y'all was dealing with, this person is, like, overly thinking about making their way back to y'all. They like, I gotta, I gotta put an end to some shit. They're like, I gotta put an end to some shit. But... Whoever this third party is thinking about rushing in and clearing up some confusion about whatever your person was doing behind your back. But what's crazy is going to be justice because it's going to put everything on the fucking table. It's going to put everything on the table. Oh, yeah. Some of y'all not talking to y'all person and they burdened. This motherfucker is they hurt. They want to come in, but it's still like they got some type of toxic energy around them clouding their judgment. King of Cups in reverse and a Queen of Cups in reverse. Neither one of them fuck with each other like that. It's just some type of toxic attachment. Some type of toxic attachment. They could be providing for this person. Nine of Pentacles with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. With this Seven of Pentacles. This person is not realizing. Like I feel like somebody could have been making y'all person feel like they need them when in reality it was the other way around. This person is now seeing like, damn, if I was to branch off, I would be good. This motherfucker would be fucked up. Where the fuck is all my money going? Mm. Yeah, this person got a decision to make. Person got a decision to make. Somebody seeing the error in their ways, and they ready to put an end to some shit. Cause this person, somebody fucked up behind y'all. They feel like they made a bad, the wrong decision. And now they trying to, yeah. Now this person, bro, this person is weighing their options on how the fuck they can come back and give you this Ace of Pentacles. They building up their strength. They walking away from a loveless situation. They tried to get their love to a motherfucker and that shit ain't work. Whatever they did to y'all, they feel like they got to come with some shit now. They feel like they got to come with an offer. They got to come with some, some monetary shit. They seeing that whatever they went back to, that was some sexual shit. And they don't want that shit no more. They don't want that shit no more. Man. 
okay we're gonna do what's going on with my divine feminines that are in union with their person let me clear my energy right quick because hunty hunty that's damn it kind of like a fucking collector all right so what is going on with my divine feminines in union with their person what is going on with my divine feminines in union with their person this turn into a love reading. I don't even, I don't even do those. What the fuck? What's going on with my divine feminists in union with their person? Let's see. What is going on with my divine feminists in union with a person? Hunty, somebody about to be able to kick their feet up. Somebody about to be able to kick their feet up. What is this Eight of Pentacles in reverse? Mmm. I feel like some of you guys are going through the process of learning how to not overwork yourself and to really, you know, allow yourself to live. This is also giving me energy like somebody wants to work. Like somebody don't want you working as hard as the fuck you be working. They want to give you something. They want to give you something. But I feel like this person... Like, whoever y'all in union with, they could see, like, damn, like, I'm doing cool, but I could be doing better. They they definitely see that shit now. Yeah. This person want to be able to celebrate their income speeding up or some type of, like, financial, like, some type of financial gain. Something is coming back. Something is coming back. Somebody could have took a financial loss or could have invested in something, and they get a return on whatever they invested in. Yeah. What's this? What is this? Yeah, somebody could have felt like they made the wrong investment at one point in time. But it's given like they don't see that it's going to work out in their favor. Justice card. What's this high priestess? Mm. Whoever this is, too, y'all person could have to, like, y'all person could be a little sad right now, too, because they got to they gotta make some sacrifices. They got to make some sacrifices. They have to get, this is Empress in reverse with this Ten of Pentacles in reverse. It's like codependent energy. It's like codependent energy. I feel like this person, low-key, too, this is like them thinking long-term with the investments that they, they about to make or they feel like they, they, oh, gosh. This person, intuitively, they know. They tunnel vision it. I feel like y'all person could be a little sad right now. But it's because they low-key know, but they in denial about it, having to cut off certain people. Having to cut off certain people. But for what they want to give you, it's only right. It's only right. Whoever y'all dealing with, they about to start communicating to people like, I can't do X, Y, and Z no more. What's this page of swords? I got to follow my passions. I got to get my bread straight. I got to invest. I found what's meant for me. I was weighing my options in the past with shit. It wasn't working out. Yeah, some of these people, y'all person, the my feminists that are in union, it's very much giving like communication to certain people that I cannot keep supplying your lifestyle. I cannot keep carrying your burdens, carrying your problems. Yeah. Some of you, like y'all person is they about to, they having to really put their foot down and telling people like I can't keep investing in this. For real, for real. It's time for me to, to be strong and put my foot down. I can't keep investing in this shit. It's it's depleting me. What is this magician? Yeah. It's one of those, it's giving like you know how they say, like, sometimes you got to take a step back from partying and hanging out with friends and really get serious about yourself. That's the energy that your person is in. Like, your person is very optimistic about the connection. But they feeling like, too, they can't really make the offer that they want to make until they get certain shit in order. But they know they got to start making cuts in other departments because it ain't no, I heard it ain't no breaking up. What's that, um, what is that song? <laughs> Super bad. We don't break up. We take breaks. Some. 
<laughs> like, yeah, somebody, somebody really on their bread. Somebody could have lied. Like, y'all person could have lied. Like, yeah, I got it all together. Money ain't an issue. Everything good. Yeah, they could have, they could have been a bit dishonest about their finances. And I feel like things started happening and they started to reveal it. This person could have slowed down on the love department because they were having some financial issues. Um, and I feel like this person, this, they might apologize as well for like a break. Yeah, but yeah, somebody could have somebody could have tried to make like a um yeah somebody tried to take a break from something at some point to get their money up, but they heart just called them back. I feel like behind the scenes they were they could have been. Mm. Somebody could have been in a, a situation where money was involved, where their finances were like tied up. Something could have came back. Somebody could have came back, said something like, oh, well, this, this has to be paid. Yeah. Somebody putting an end to that shit, though. Some like y'all person, some of y'all person be going through the fucking ringer with people in regards to money. Yeah, they be going through the ring with people in regards to money. Death card, nine of swords, distempers. They putting the end to that shit, though. They tired of crying over what they don't have. And they ready to heal. Some of y'all, a uh, person has codependent issues as well. So it's like one of those. They feel like they have to be there for people. You know, despite if it puts them in a fucked up position. They, they healing through that now. Okay, well, that was a love section. What is going on with my divine feminists? So what's going on financially with my divine feminists? What is going on financially with my divine feminist? Somebody could be having a toothache. My tooth just started feeling weird. What's going on financially with my divine feminist? Mmm. Oh. Some of y'all could be in energy where it's like, I, I'm, I'm cool on everything. I'm just trying to focus on this bag. What y'all don't even realize is y'all probably at the point where it's like, I am motherfucking tired. When you get tired, you got to get sick and tired of your current conditions in order to bring in change. Some of y'all about to get some type of lump sum. What is this ace? A pip? Girl! Girl! What is this? Some type of court case about to be over and you about to get paid out. Whatever this is, this payout is... Yeah, something didn't go in somebody's favor. What's this? This higher front in reverse, this will of fortune in reverse. Yeah. It could be some funds getting released from it could be a cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini involved. Some funds is getting released from something. Some some court case is over with. And some type of funds is gonna get released, and it's gonna put you in a position. Uh, it's going to put you in a position. This is money that was due to you. Some of y'all are getting back some money that was due to you. Mm. Some of y'all had somebody that took something from y'all and they would like they were literally giving you the bare minimum on the emotion side, trying to hide that they did not give you your fucking money. With this seven of swords, page of cups, and this three of pentacles in reverse, they was low key trying to be nice here and there. Yeah, but the the fact that they were lying about this shit, it became too much of a burden. Somebody was trying to stall out a court case or some shit. They were trying to figure out diff different ways to not give you what the fuck was due to you. Oh, but that shit over with. And they about to be stuck. Yes. Oh, baby, you about to have a new beginning. Somebody was really trying to keep you stuck within a situation with conflict. They didn't want you healing. They wanted you to be in conflict. Oh, but y'all, this, this, this fool card with this five of swords, some of y'all might be moving real soon, too. Once y'all get this deposit, y'all might be moving. Yup. Justice coming for a toxic motherfucker. Some, some of y'all had a motherfucker trying to hold something from y'all. This justice with this devil with this tower card and the ten of cups. Somebody had like, it's very, man. It's one of those, they've been watching this money too. Some of y'all who are like, say like if y'all do, I heard like, what are, like if y'all do one million, this motherfucker probably gave you like a hundred dollars one time. So I don't act like I ain't never did nothing for you. 
run me my money ho what are you talking about yeah like some of y'all this is exactly what was slowing y'all up i feel like a lot of you guys were so focused on stability and money that y'all really wasn't giving too much energy to love whoever was holding y'all money they knew this shit too whatever this is about to get released is going to help y'all the ten of cups is coming the ten of cups is coming somebody is salty as hell somebody salty as hell Whoever this is, this could have been a person that was holding this and they could have been in partnership. This is the Queen of Pentacles in reverse with the Emperor in reverse. This this feminine energy could have been the type that's ungrounded. She could have a little fucking issue going on within herself. She could be in lack. And then it's Emperor in reverse. This is a motherfucker that just like, ugh. They did this shit to hold leverage to be on top. These people could also gave money out to different people as well. Somebody in this equation don't have to work because of that fucking money. But that shit coming back on them. These people being overly obsessing over whatever the fuck this situation is. Because that shit coming back to haunt their ass. Ooh. Yup. These people might even be rushing in. They don't want you to be strong. They don't want you to heal the shit. Y'all could even cut these people off. This was crazy. This was fucking crazy. Some of y'all... Man, what's... Man... Her destiny swapping. Some of y'all could have had a motherfucker that tried to destiny swap with y'all. Like, I was just telling somebody, like, um, I know of a situation where somebody is due for karma. And their karma is to always be fucking working and still not feel like they're making enough. And they tried to destiny swap with a person that was due for unlimited abundance. Somebody that, you know, that knows how to call him abundance, not stress, manifest, all of that. And they tried to destiny swap. You cannot permanently do no shit like that. Yeah, so that shit is coming back to fuck around for somebody. What's going on with my divine feminist um, with finances? Ew, some of y'all have somebody that you have not spoken to coming back. Somebody about to make some type of emotional confession or make a offer y'all something. This is like, I heard like a, I got a proposition for you. You don't even want to communicate with this person. This could be a Libra Aquarius Gemini. Heavy on this Aquarius energy. Somebody feel like they owe you and they just want to show you like a gesture like this person has been crying over something that they did to you in the past. And they feel like in order to really wrap up this cycle, they got to do something nice for you. This person could even came into some money and they decided like, OK, well, I guess say like they got like seven racks. They want to give you like a, a thousand of that. Like they want to do something to help you out. Mm. some of y'all got somebody as well that came into some this is somebody separate somebody came into some money money and this person is lying about watching you they watching you heavy as hell they want to come back this person i feel like they could have been making you know they could have made the wrong decision in regards to a love interest and they ended up with somebody that didn't really fuck with them that was really fucking with them for the money and what's crazy when they were fucking with this person they did not get the money and so they ended up leaving this person this person is following their intuition now they want to apologize and they more optimistic in regards to you but i feel like whatever they did they could have been trying to build happiness with a cheater And what they didn't see is that shit brought them bad karma. That shit brought them bad karma. Yup. That shit brought them bad karma. Now this person, like, they see, like, the skills are not balanced. This person wants to come back and heal something with you. You guys could be having, for the ones that is having, like, financial, you know, a little financial issue right now. They want to come back and heal that. They want to come back and help you and clear up some confusion. yeah some of y'all somebody don't want you working no more <laughs> they keep coming out somebody don't want you working no more like oh my gosh okay like <laughs> oh i just got all giddy <laughs> i play too much sometimes yeah i just heard too somebody is upset because somebody is like wearing options but with somebody else okay any more messages for my divine feminine? 
Yeah, somebody, like, it's a tower hidden. And I feel like y'all probably don't even know about it. Something that y'all thought was over is not over. Court cases, all that shit. Like, I feel like it's a lot of shit coming to the forefront. Yes. Y'all getting a lot of downloads right now, too. Somebody's about to make their way for some of y'all. Somebody about to make their way back. They weigh their options and they see like they will have the world with you and they want to offer you something. They have to walk away from some shit though. They have to build up their strength to walk away from shit to be able to make an offer to you. This person been in their head about whatever lie that they told you. They could have lied and said they cut somebody off and they didn't, but they got a little distant towards you because they made a bad decision. Somebody tried to have a partnership with somebody that was not who the fuck they said they was. Mm-hmm. Mm. somebody also had to cut somebody off in order to be somebody had somebody around them that was keeping their ass low vibrational as hell keeping them in in fear and anxiety and all that shit somebody is coming back somebody just a little a little worried that when they come back like they feel like you just done with their ass they feel like you are done with them but they ready to speed things up they ready to speed things up what is this two of cups yeah, some of y'all, somebody could have had to cut out um, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. This person is worked the fuck up. It's, it was some cheating going on. It was some type of toxicity to block an investment. But justice is coming. Somebody wasn't thinking when they did some shit. But somebody is able to get out of a contract. Somebody binded themselves to somebody, but somebody is getting out of some, um, some shit. Divine timing is at play for them to be able to release that. Yes, four of pentacles in reverse with this ten of swords with this four of swords. Divine timing is at play. They successfully coming out of some shit. They could be seeing a lot of fours and tens on the right path to end this for new beginnings. Yes, somebody wasn't taking action or somebody might not be taking action because they're healing right now as well. Oh, yeah, but they watching. Somebody about to communicate to some of y'all. They've had to put an end to some shit. Somebody could have been living a fast life. It's the end to that shit now. It's the answer to that shit. Or somebody could have been doing something like unhealthy for fast money. It's the answer to that shit as well. Whew. Divine Feminine, y'all got a lot of shit going on. All right, so what is the advice of my Divine Feminines? Your efforts, determination, and perseverance have paid off. But it's time to look at how you value yourself. There are issues with self love. Okay. Self love. Oh my gosh. Oh. <sighs> what's that song by avant candy coating raindrops okay. memories of you when you when you were mine <laughs> i don't know the words alone is it Y'all, you are being encouraged to walk away from a current conflict. A partnership is blessed and destined for greatness. Y'all, anything that's stressing you the fuck out, that's not bringing you peace, it's time for you to cut ties with that shit. Y'all got to make room for them blessings. Somebody also is being encouraged to walk away from something because they see a partnership is blessed and destined for greatness. Communicate clearly and don't be afraid. Tell her how it is. Let go of desire outcomes and you will get what you want. Ask the universe and angels for help and guidance, y'all. It's time to clear our old negative thoughts and feelings. Start to apply what you already know and trust your intuition. It's time for y'all to work on y'all self-love and call out to y'all ancestors in the universe for assistance. Divine timing is at play for y'all. Period, point blank. Uh, this new moon. I keep hearing new moon. I found you, Miss New Booty. Yes, Miss New Booty. Some of y'all might be getting y'all booty done. Mm -hmm. But okay. Divine Feminists, thank y'all for joining me. I greatly appreciate y'all. Sitting down having tea with Pabs. That's some good shit coming in. I need to put my wig back there. <laughs> Thank y'all. Do not forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe if this is your story. Yeah.